right, Kay, I have a Dollar Tree haul for you real quick. We're going to make this really fast. My glasses are going to flare, but I'm sorry, I got to put them on. We're going to make this really fast because I have a lasagna in the oven, and I know the oven's about to go off. So, Dollar Tree, everything's a dollar. We all know the concept. Let's get to it. I'm going to get, I'm speeding through. I'm sorry, guys. This is about the only time I can film for like the next few days. First things first, they have the fake beauty blenders. Um, you just get them wet. It's like a beauty blender. I use these all the time. Actually, I have one in the everyday makeup thing. Um, I got them for a dollar on eBay with free shipping. I have like a basket with like five of backups sitting over there. But I figured I'm going to buy them. I'm going to keep buying them. They were already at a Dollar Tree. I didn't have to wait for um, shipping because they take like three weeks to come from China. So I went ahead and picked up five of them. I got three green, another pink, and a purple. I mean, dollar a piece. That's what I get them for on eBay. So I figured I might as well just get them while I'm in the store while they have them. Um, the next thing we're going to do, it says new. I don't know how new they are. I've never seen them. They're Elf Lotion Wipes in Sweet Mango. These things are amazing. I actually have one out right now for... I had one out for makeup remover. It's a, it's a wipe for lotion. You put it on your body and it's like soaks in instantly. They smell like mango. They smell like a, a car freshener. So they smell amazing. But they actually take off makeup really well. Um, they were a buck. So it was cheaper than the makeup remover wipes. And they are... They don't like grease up your face, so I absolutely love these. I am going to go back and get more because these are amazing. Um, the next thing I got was I got two lotions. I'm going to only, I'll tell you how they smell. I'm not going to, I've already tried them. Um, this one's going to be a gift. This one I'm keeping. Um, this is a shea butter. This one's called Cozy Kiss. This one's like a strong, like perfumey, like actually it's kind of like, a musky, like warm vanilla y with a little bit of perfume to it that's going for a Christmas present. This one I'm keeping for myself. Again, everything's a dollar. This one is sweet lace. I got that mango. Um, it's like a real sugary, it smells like a bath and body works smell. And this lotion is really nice for a buck. Like it is it's not too thick, but it's shea butter. It doesn't feel greasy and it smells amazing. That's a pretty strong smell. All right, next thing I got was an e.l.f. Super Glossy Lip Shine. It was a dollar. This one's an angel. It's just a regular lip gloss. Um, it's going to be a Christmas present, so I'm not opening it. It's just a clear gloss with iridescent. I also have a e.l.f. Liquid Eyeliner in brown coffee. It's called coffee. It's just a brown liquid eyeliner. It's a brush. It's not one of the felt tip applicators. Very, very pigmented. Um, only a dollar. I didn't have a liquid eyeliner in brown, so I went ahead and got that. Um, I went ahead and got Sassy and Chic BB Beauty Benefit Cream. This has acne treatment with salicylic acid, multi-action, skincare, and makeup. It is super light. It's like white. It's not even light, which is the color it's supposed to be. Like, I mean, this is like white. It's like pure white. It's like yeah, it's got like imperfect, it fixes imperfections for all skin types. It's a thick, you know, I put it on with a beauty blender. But I mean, I'm so white that it's like right there that it, it actually will work for me, which is insane. But um, but it's got the acne fighting stuff. So like I have a lot of breakup breakouts, breakouts right now, which is why I'm not wearing any makeup. Um, so I'm going to start trying this out in the next couple of days. This is, which I bought this for a buck, and I just got one in my boxy charm. This is a wet gloss lash and brow from e.l.f. I will use both ends. One end is supposed to be, they're different. There's one wand that's a little different. This one's the eyebrow wand. And then the lash wand is a little bit shorter and whatever. I don't use clear mascara. So this will be used for my brows. Both ends will be used for a brow. Put it with a dollar. So I'll do a brow gel for a buck. Um, I got an e.l.f. Jumbo Lip Gloss Stick. I have another one of these. I really like it. This one is in Flirty and Girly. They're they're pretty, sh they're light. You can build them up. That's like 10 swipes back and forth. It's very glossy, very shimmery. It looks like a lip gloss. And a 
stick form, which I love. And then we have a couple, let me wipe some of this stuff off. The, that lotion wipe just took off the liner, the gloss, the makeup. It takes it off like a makeup remover wipe and they're a dollar at my Dollar Tree right now. And actually I have this liquid lipstick stuck on my hand and I have been trying to get it off like an hour now with makeup remover wipes. And most of it just came off with the lotion wipe. So there you go. You're welcome. Next thing I got is the Profusion Glitterati Journal in Leopard. I have one. I have the blue one. I have the silver one. I gave it to my sister for more browns. I got these somewhere else for like three bucks. And these don't have glitter in them. I mean, like they're kind of like a metallic -y shimmer. But there's no glitter. This one, so I don't know if I got like an old batch or something. But all of the ones at the Dollar Tree for a buck, I can't get it open, I actually have like glitter. You can see, see, you can see it on this one. It actually has like glitter in it. I was like, I might go back and get that brown one again. But I like these colors. They're very pigmented. Let me block them. Look, I'm getting. Go ahead. The problem with these is they're so buttery, they come off in like chunks. But it's like a. These are like foil shadows. So I totally need to be. Stepping up my game and going back and getting them before they so I'll be talking somewhere they're like so crazy pigmented. All of them are like this, so it doesn't matter which ones I swatch. Alright. Bam. Metallic and foil. So I'm probably gonna go back and get the other two because let me show you the one I got from the other beauty supply store in Illinois. I'll swatch them for you and they're not gonna show no they're not gonna foil. Like this one does. They're not as, as buttery and they don't pick up as like creamy. They're good, but they're not like crazy. See? They're just right there. These just look like regular shadows. These are like super foiled. So I'm probably going to pick up a couple more of those. I'll probably do it tomorrow. Um, along with some more of the face wipes. Now, let's see. I got an e.l.f. palette for a buck. This one's called Beautiful Brown. Got that lotion thing on my hands. They're wet. It's not greasy, it's just my hands are wet. There's four shadows in here. They're really pretty. I'll go ahead and swatch all of them. The only thing I don't like is like how little this is. It's hard to get my fingers in my dirty even swatch it. So I'm sure it's gonna be kind of hard to get a brush through there. And I'm I'm assuming these are older from e.l.f. I don't know. They're nice and pigmented though. I mean, they're a really nice little brown palette. Little, it's on the go. So I really like that. I might pick one up for my sister for Christmas. She doesn't watch my channel, I don't think, so far that I know. So then I got an LA Colors palette. This one's an orchid. It's brown. Um, they're both kind of brown, coppery colors, but they are a little different. I'll show them side by side. This one's sunflower, this one's orchid. They're a little bit different. Um they're not the same. The closest shades are these two dark browns, and they're not even picking up on camera as close to me. And I'm like as close as they are in person. But they are a little bit different. Again, I might pick some of these up for my sister because she's really into brown shadows, and they're a buck. I already gave her make her Christmas stuff. She came over asking for a bunch of makeup. I'm like, I'm about to give her this stuff for her birthday next month and Christmas. Two months after I might as well just give her her Christmas present. I gave it to her and I was like don't cry when you get nothing for Christmas, but she's still getting stuff for Christmas. She don't, she don't know about it. That girl just got like so much makeup. Okay, that's the orchid one. So I've got a pink, like a goldish color, and a brown. I know that timer on the oven is about to go off. I'll have to burn my lasagna. That's what I called it when I was a little lasagna. Got a G in there. It's not being used. I'm going to use it. Don't give me something that ain't going to be used. I'm going to use it. <laughs> and actually, these two golden colors are very similar, but they're just a couple shades off. So here's the um, sunflower palette, here's a brown, a coppery color, and a golden color. And they're very pigmented, they're very nice, they're a buck. Um, I might get some other ones when I go back in there. Okay, and then, almost done. And then we have these two that are supposed to be like knockoff Victoria's Secret ones. 
I know this is supposed to be a knockoff love spell. But I do not know what this one's supposed to be. I don't know what scent this is, but I love it. It does not smell familiar to me from Bath and Body Works, but this is coconut hibiscus. And it's exactly what it smells like. It's coconut hibiscus and it lasts all day. And it's a freaking dollar. I absolutely love it. This one is supposed to be love spell. It's cherry blossom and jasmine. And I think the love spell says peach. I have a bottle of love spell in there, but it it has that like strong pungent, like not pungent in a bad way, but that strong like love spell smell. But it's not, it's a little different. It's got like that strong peachy smell to it with the with the flowers, but it's just a little bit different when you spray it on and use it. So that is it from the Dollar Tree. <coughs> Anything I go back for tomorrow will just be different colors of the palette and eyeshadows. Um or just get more for my sister. So I won't make I, I don't know, I might make another video and show you guys. Especially if they have anything else. Um I have one more video I want to shoot, but I don't know if I have the time. Um so I might have to do that later. But uh that was my Dollar Tree haul. I think that was pretty good. My, my Dollar Tree doesn't have as much as like of the higher end stuff, higher end like Milani and stuff like that as like the other people that I see hauling. We don't get as good of stuff out here in Valparaiso. So. so I thought that was a pretty decent one. I do like those palettes. So I will be going back for more. Um, thanks for watching and please subscribe. See you later.